say a deadly road race on Dale Mabry Highway cost a Tampa woman her life, and now a second suspect, the driver of the other vehicle involved, is behind bars. That crash happened at the intersection of North Dale Mabry and West South Avenue on June 3rd. News Channel 8's Alessandra Young joins us live outside the Tampa Police Department with how they found that second driver. Stacy TPD says the media coverage of this deadly crash may have made the difference in finding that second driver. Officer Nick Wilson with TPD says media coverage of the fatal crash helped get the word out. We received a phone call on Monday from a representative of 19 year old Daniel Hernandez. The representative advised that Mr. Hernandez was operating the motor vehicle that we were looking for, in this case, the black Camaro. He also requested a meeting. During that meeting, Wilson says they interviewed Hernandez and a passenger. The passenger was in the vehicle at the time of the crash. Uh, they were not in actively participating in the racing. As we saw on the video, they will not be facing charges. This deadly highway racing crash killed a woman in her 60s and injured the male driver. The driver of the vehicle is still in the hospital. He faces a long road of recovery. Isaiah Hernandez, who works nearby and saw the crash, says people race along the highway too often. It's bad around here. People don't pay attention. People are constantly speeding up and down this road all day, all hours, and something really needs to be done about it. Both suspects, Andy Moya Robanya and Daniel Hernandez, are charged with vehicular homicide and racing. Hernandez is also charged with leaving the scene. Wilson says there is never an excuse to race on public highways. We all drive these roads. We all want to go home at the end of the day. Do not race. Officer Wilson says that if you witness any street racing or see it on social media, you are asked to contact their non-emergency line. Live in Tampa, Alessandra Young, 8 on your side.